Everybody pray for me. It's been a day for me. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I remember syrup sandwiches and crime allowances Finessing on them with some counterfeits But now I'm counting this Parmesan with my accountant lips In fact, I'm down in this Douce with my boobie Tastes like Kool-Aid for the analyst Girl, I can buy your Westy world with my base stuff I know that it's good, won't you say Hi, it's Mr. Ray and Lion And we're here to talk about The student we're most proud of is Maliki Condi in the fifth grade I am most proud of Maliki because he went from a failing grade on the first day of the practice exam to an 82 on the second day of the practice of the exam. And he was so close to a four. And the reason I'm proud of Maliki is it's all about confidence with him. He made minor changes to his technique and his level of focus, and he was able to do amazing things. Sit down. Also, Miss Kim, just to add an extra one, because Miss Stone and Miss Kim, they are a really great help, and the way that they basically explain the math concepts helps me to understand it. So that's part of the reason why I get fours and I pass. I feel prepared for the state math exam because the teachers have given me a lot of tools and confidence to run this test. I have seen our scholars grow in multiple ways. They have gone from being sloppy math mathematicians to great mathematicians who are paying attention to questions, who are neatly showing their work, and yeah, like because of those steps, they actually are able to calculate precisely and catch any minor mistakes. Okay, so I've seen so much growth from my students that I've, I've worked with in tutoring, just like where you guys started. To, to how you are just getting it every single day now has so impressed me. Um, I'm definitely most proud, I would say, of, of a lot of kids, but of... I think I'm prepared for the math state exam because actually I've been studying a lot hard with fractions and decimals, and if I keep studying hard, then I'm able to pass. I'm able to have my knowledge. Ms. Rakowski is a great math teacher because she is actually funny. She helps us with our difficult problems, and she is very nice to us. Right, we have two semi-circles. So the change that I've seen from September till now, especially in the students that I've been tutoring, has been you know crazy. It's been immense. Um, I'm really, really proud of the strides that we've made. I'm really proud of the way that we've overcome these challenges that we've you know we started with. Um, in particular, Waleski. When I first met her, you know, it would seem as if everything that I put in front of her was just this huge challenge that she wasn't gonna be, gonna be able to do. But these days I put complex questions and she does it in a snap or at the very least she tries. I feel prepared for this math exam. Um, I do because um, we have all these practices and um, like, um, what practices like we're doing the practice um, math rate test so that um, I feel like I feel more confident that I can do my best on the test and I won't like, be like scared of the test. So I'll be able to perform my best and get the highest score possible. Now it's time. Now it's time. Now it's time. You guys to show the city. You guys show the whole city that you're the best. You're the best. I can't believe that the math test is finally here. I've been waiting for a long, long time. But I've been watching you guys over the past few months. I've been keeping track of your scores. I've been keeping track of your data. And I'm really, really, really proud of all the progress you have made. I have actually a few names here. Um, Samara, Elijah, Seku, Makano, Miriyama, Jaden, Tamia, Anaya, uh, Fatima, Idalis, Leah, Kevin, Tyson, Waleski, Shania. Those are just a few of the names that I've seen make a lot of progress since last year. And I'm really, really proud of you. I know, I know that this is your year. Hi everyone, just checking in from your old alma mater here at the elementary school. It's been a while since I've seen some of your faces. How about you come visit us once in a while? I've heard such great things about all of your math accomplishments this year, and I know that you're going to make Bronx 2 proud on this assessment. Keep up all your hard work, and I can't wait to hear how you do.
Hey Bronx 2, I miss you guys so, so much. Today is your big day. I am already so proud of you guys. I've heard how hard you have been working and I know you're going to slam this exam. Nobody does it like my Bronx 2 babies. So listen up. This is what you have to do today. You already know what it is. Interpret the question, make a plan, check your work and be urgent. You guys have done this time and time again. Show everybody what you're made of. I know what you're capable of. You should know what you're capable of. Slam this exam. To three, Chris McCullough for the two game stint with the Long Island Nets at 17. What's up everybody? It's Chris McCullough from the Bronx, New York. Current member of the Washington Wizards. Mr. Stone tells me you have a manifest approaching, but just need a little motivation. So I'm just here to give you that, that extra push so you can excel and do great. And always believe in yourself. Remember that. Good luck with everything. Good luck with the test. And I'll see y'all later. I know what you're capable of. You should know what you're capable of. Slam this exam.